What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's me, Oob. I'm here today trying something new. So I'm going to try to do a podcast. I bought all this podcast stuff. and Well, first thing I want to talk to you guys about, and I've seen this on a couple different websites, but right now I'm at APN or APnews.com. I don't know if I'm going to get in trouble for this or not, but it says Oklahoma lawmaker proposes Bigfoot hunting season. All right. Now, I've been hunting a few times in my life. I own guns and bows and all of that. But, and I live in the woods, so <laughs> go figure. I have never seen a Bigfoot in all my 40 years of being alive. Um,. And if I ever did, this is just, I mean, hypothetically speaking, or if you will, joking around, I will shoot it. (laughs) I'm going to invoke the rights of South Park and yell, it's coming right at me, and I'm going to shoot that motherfucker. And then I'm going to take pictures and everything else, and there's your Bigfoot. But... I mean, what? I mean, look. I ain't even got into the story yet, but look. They want a hunt license for a Bigfoot, a creature that ninety percent of us, maybe ninety-five percent of humanity, has only ever seen on YouTube, or, you know, uh, what what other what other ones are there that uh, chasing Bigfoot and you know stuff like that. I mean, if the creature's out there, it's out there. And it stayed hitting pretty good. Leave it the fuck alone. I mean, there you go. I mean, what's next? What's next? We're going to have, oh, I believe there's a unicorn, so I'm going to get a unicorn hunting license? I mean, come on, guys. Shit. But anyways, back to the Bigfoot hunting season. All right. I I don't fully understand why you would want a Bigfoot hunting Oh, okay, here we go. Here we go. Humphrey says this bill would only would only allow trapping and that he is he also hopes to secure a twenty five thousand dollars to be offered as a bounty for a lot. He wants to take it alive. Oh man, Chuck. Oh man. I mean do we not do we not learn anything from you know, this thing is like, got to be the ultimate, like, predator, so to speak. I mean, I've never seen a, a Bigfoot, and I'm pretty sure most of you guys have never seen a Bigfoot. And if you have, I want real proof. I don't want, oh, well, this picture was taken in 19, what, no. I don't, I don't, if anything, get it on one of the old, um, old, uh, what the fuck are them things called now, man? The old cameras we used to have, the, the Polaroids or whatever, where it spits the fucking picture right out at you? Yeah. That I might believe. That I I might be able to believe one of them, but I don't know, man. I don't think Bigfoot exists. I mean, if it did, it's it's got to be one of the smartest creatures in the world. I mean, to stay hidden to where, what, five people maybe maybe a couple more than that a year might see one i mean that's all of the world people i mean so i don't know if i agree with the whole uh bigfoot hunting license uh, i mean especially taking it alive i mean how the fuck are you gonna take this creature alive i mean i don't think you're allowed to just go down to your to your Walmart or your uh, tractor supply or something like that and pick up Bigfoot knockout darts to go hunting. I mean, I don't know. I don't know, but that's, I mean, you got to think that one out a little bit more before you throw that one out there, lawmaker in Oklahoma. I just, I, I don't know, guys. I, I don't know, man. There, I don't know. 
Alright. Next thing I want to talk to you guys about would be the, the, the violent squirrels. What is that? New York, I think. New York, New Jersey in a park. I think I read somewhere earlier there was one with a fucking knife. Okay, dude, it don't take but a pellet gun to take care of your problem. I mean, come on, people. And then, then if you're lucky and it didn't need to, a bunch of garbage, like, going around, like, the towns and shit, you can't, like, like, shoot a squirrel in the middle of town, you know, and then take it home and eat it. I mean, I'm pretty sure you could, but I'm pretty sure I wouldn't trust that. I'd, if it's in a park, I'd hunt a squirrel in a heartbeat. But one dude even said it was like an MMA match, and he lost. Dude, this squirrel's fucking not even a foot. How are you going to lose, man? It's going to come up. You're going to see it. You're going to punt it. Or grab that, or grab it by its fucking, I mean, oh my God, dude. I don't, I don't understand people sometimes. I really, I just, I really don't. And I don't know. But a pellet gun, a BB gun, dude. Five, maybe ten pumps on a BB gun. You're taking the squirrel down, dude. I mean, come on. Why, why are you letting your place get polluted with squirrels that have started to uh, colonize, we'll say, or deciding to stake their claim of this park or wherever? I got to find it before I go any further on it. But, dude, a pellet gun, dude, BB gun. 50 bucks take care of your problem because I'd be damned be damned if I see some squirrels fucking using knives and shit I'd be damned be damned now I know a lot of people are going to be like oh well that's kind of ignorant of you they're this and they're that yeah they're also lunch you get you like five ten squirrels together Fuck yeah, dude. You got you a nice little pot of grave squirrel gravy. Mm. Oh, right here. Yeah, right here, New York. Residents of Queens, New York. Now, come on, dude. That's Queens, man. I know you guys packing heat. <laughs> uh, are dealing with a squirrel threat. Yeah. Okay, Queens, New York. Uh, hire me. I will come in here. And I will lay savagely waste to all of your squirrels. I won't eat them. Because that's... That's a neighborhood. But if they're in the woods... Fuck yeah. Come call on Oob. Oob, Oob, Oob will take care of your problem. Hold on a minute, I'm reading it. Because I don't want to get in trouble. Yeah, aggressive squirrels have jumped on them, bitten them in the past several weeks. Yeah, shoot the fucking squirrel. Take out the ringleader and then start taking his other little peoples out. I mean, come on, dude. And they bark like this. Come on. This is just my opinion on this. I mean, a lot of people are going to say I'm ignorant. But I don't give a fuck. Okay. I mean, why, dude? What? Okay, here it is. This was an MMA match. Hold on. It says this was an MMA cage match and I lost. What? Lady, you ever take a pencil in your hand and hold it firmly and push with your thumb and it snap? That's all it takes. Yeah, aggressive, going after people. No, those squirrels have rabies. <laughs> I never in my life had a squirrel attack me, and I have hunted for many, many, many years. Okay? But, that that's, what's the matter, people? Huh? Can you not fix it with your fucking Android? Can you not fix it with, with the phone? I mean, I understand if you can't pull... I understand if you can't kill a, a fucking rodent. I understand that. But there comes a time in your life where... What if you have to? What if... What if 
like something happens and God forbid it. God forbid that, man. But say something happens, you got to eat squirrels, dude. I'm glad I got used to eating them. Same thing with deer. What happens if you got to go out and hunt you a big old buck, big old Bambi? I mean, come on. The best meat in the fucking world, man. But, again, that's my opinion. I know people are going to be fucking douche canoes on the, in the comments. But, I'm going to hit it once more for you guys. And I just thought I'd talk about them two things that, that have... I've seen them a couple times in a couple days when I'm flipping through. But I don't understand it, dude. But this here thing here, this if you guys haven't, <laughs> if you guys haven't yet, this uh, gingerbread monolith delights San Francisco on Christmas Day. I mean, I know this is old news, but. It, it's the last thing to pop up, and, uh, I'm sorry, guys, I think I got a cold. Um, yeah, dude, see, something like that, that's cool, man, that, that's awesome. But, I don't know. Fucking squirrels using knives and fucking, um, hunting license for, a for a Sasquatch. I mean, come on. That's gotta be the... I mean, I understand it's a lot of dumb, a lot of really fucked up shit that's went on in 2020, but we're not even in the second month into 2021, and we got revolting squirrels and people hunting Sasquatch. <laughs> I mean, okay, that's what the world's turned into, that's what it's turned into. <laughs> oh, sorry, I can't even say that with a straight face. But, alright guys, it's me, Oob. Remember, like, share, comment, and subscribe. Peace. I love yous.